guys, welcome to Broadway TV. My name is Omoye, your host for today. Right now, we are at the Genesis Cinema for Omonyo Police premiere screening, Rise on Strike. Trust me, there's much to be seen here today, and I bet you don't want to miss a team. Stay with us, we'll be right back. Don't go nowhere. My name is Mona Lisa Chinda Koka and you're tuned to Broadway TV. Don't touch your dial. Hi, this is Ufuma McDermott. You're watching Broadway TV. Hi, my name is Udoka Oyeka. Keep watching Broadway TV. My name is Yabo Ojo. Keep watching Broadway TV. Hi, this is Blessing Ebe and you are watching Broadway TV. Hi, my name is Chika Chibu and I'm an actress. You're watching Broadway TV. How can you rate um, among your police performance in this movie? Oh, from what I've seen, I'll give it a, I'll give it a 9.8 just because I'm not that sweet to give it 10. <laughs> so, a 9.8 will do for now. She did, a, she did an amazing work. Choma Chukuka brought her A game. Uche Jongo was fantabulous. In fact, I was jealous. I said to her, why didn't you give me this Uche Jongo's role to play? Because it's my kind of thing, you know. And um, Ufama, as always, is a perfectionist when it comes to things like this and she brought it it's a beautiful piece it's a great ensemble the cast the storyline and everything in between it's it's i would recommend it uh, from what i've seen she's she's she has evolved and uh, she is not doing badly in all ramifications being an actor in producing in directing in executive producing her movies, she's not doing badly at all. And I really, really want to use this medium to say congratulations. You've stayed focused, you are determined, you're a strong woman, and that's all we need to do for ourselves. Encourage one another, and you've done so well. Congratulations one more time. Uh, the truth is, Omoni is not just a, um, a great actor. I, I wish that a lot of people would experience her as a director like we have. She's seamless. She's very, very seamless. Very calculating too. Um, because I was really surprised when I thought, okay, she'd have her process and then just enforce her process and say, oh babes, this you know, this is what I want. And but it wasn't quite that. It was a fusion of what she had in mind and what she thought my interpretation of the role was. And you know, there was like a meeting point. So it was it felt good as an actor to feel like your director is also willing to listen to you to say, okay, you know, I think that this character can be this this way and so it was beautiful I really really hope that people experience her as a director as a director she was just trying that thing this one help her grow and no good line she self knew she was just trying to put it together so I'm sure it is a team process okay. and I'm sure now she understands her onions better okay. everybody has a first time the stage I'm sure before then she had tried her hands in other ones but once you have a good team good DOP good people that can put it together Trust me, I am always a supporter of women, understanding and taking charge. But now what's your expectation of this? Hi, like I said, I said my expectations are high. So I can't wait to see what I look like two years ago before my health challenge. So good. Yeah, so I can't wait. I'm expecting to learn a lot from it because I know it's a story that has to, you know, that has to do with women issues in marital homes. I, I hope so. I know so. So I'm um, hoping to learn a lot from that, you know, and see how she kind of explain her own aspect of having to deal with marriages. And all that. So I was almost going to ask if you've seen the trailer. Um, actually, no, I haven't. But I know it's going to be a good movie, definitely. Now, can you rate Amonio Bully's performance so far in producing? She's a fantastic actress, you know, so I'll give her a 90 of 100. She's good, she's good, yes, she's good. Because uh, I know Moni Ogoli and we've worked together on being Mrs. Elliot, so I know the energy. And when you hear wives on strike as women, it's got to be a lot of energy in it. Uh, entertainment, excitement, so I'm just looking to be entertained. Um, well, I mean, we, she's proved herself in the previous film that she's done, you know, from the first lady to uh, being Mrs. Elliot, you know, so she's she she's not a newcomer to, to the industry, you know, so she's she's only getting better with each film she does. Um, but hats off to her for, for wrapping up another film and, and putting it out there again. 
Uh, salut. Okay, last but not the least. Now, wait, what we've seen so far on Wise on Strike, do you think such um, thing happens in Nigeria of today? Uh, of course not. Okay. Uh, you hear stories about uh, uh, women not uh, putting out for their husbands when, when he's messed up. You know, so this is just uh, a collective, a collective movement on that same concept. You know, so it's, it's a brilliant one. You know, of course. <laughs> of course. Okay, not in total, but yes, at home. Sometimes when couples are very mad at each other, the woman usually use the weakness of the man to, you know, decide. You know, I'm going to deal with you today. No, nothing for you this night. So it happens. Uh, no, no. Our culture does not permit it. You know, for a woman to go on strike in a matrimonial home, that's trouble <laughs> from your in-laws. <laughs> but I know it's not going to be strike, strike, strike. I know the strike has its own significance to the movie. So I'm definitely sure we're going to learn what what is. I, I need to understand why it's on strike. I hope they actually didn't go on strike. <laughs> Because if they go on strike, yeah. the side chicks will be very happy. <laughs> it happens every day. It happens behind closed doors. It happens in every home. It happens to me. It happens to you. I mean, sometimes your husband says, I'm not going to do this. And you say, okay, calm down. <laughs> I mean, we, we all do it. We do it. So, I mean, he, she, she just put this in perspective and for a good cause. So, you know, it's, it's relatable. It's not just about Nigeria. It happens across the world. It depends on what you're using as a method for your strike. So, and it's not just women who go on strike, you know. But for wives to go on strike, hey, I think we should go on strike more. <laughs> How about we go on strike for the full scarcity oh, right now? <laughs> no, why? <laughs> I'm, I'm in the mood for that. But yeah, anyways, I guess it, it's a social consciousness that grows. Obviously, yes. Does it happen in Nigeria? I think so. It depends on where you're looking at it. As you can see, there are a variety of women across different classes that have been involved in this particular picture. So it would depend. I'm sure that market women who either sell or business women come up with different situations. They might not call it strike, but it depends. It's a social consciousness. Everybody will enjoy it, irrespective of class, status. I had fun. Well done, Tomoni and the cast and crew. Thumbs up, like fantastic. I am so impressed. I haven't been to a cinema or to a premiere in years. Um, but I am so happy that Uche Jogo dragged me out here tonight. It was every single minute you spend here is worth it. If I have to, if they have to play the movie all over again, I would sit and still see it. We, it went beyond sending a message, you know. It was, it was, it's, it's, it's just beautiful. It's an experience, really. Everyone should come out here and support our money on this project. It's a fantastic experience. You'll be very happy that you came out. I think Boys of Strike is a highly entertaining movie, and it will be your money's worth if you come out to see it. It's funny. Casting is perfect. Everything is great. Everything just comes together to make a great movie. So I'm, I'm, I can, you know, I can say strongly that Wise on Strike, I recommend it. Go and see it. It's funny and you would have fun and be entertained. I think it was amazing. It was lovely. It was everything. I kept on laughing from beginning to end. No jokes, no stories. I think it's a wonderful movie. I think it took too long even get this kind of story out. So I'm really thanking Omori for this because it's about time. It's about time. I think um, I, I think this is a very very good film. I mean, we are very much impressed with it. We think um, Omori Oboli is what we call a sleeper in the in our cinema world because she's quietly 
she's quietly making up a lot of force within the industry. I, I mean, she did Bane Miss Elliot, which was an amazing, amazing, amazing film. She did First Lady, which was another uh, amazing film. That was the fourth highest grossing film last year. And now this film, Wives on Strike, it's not, you know, it's not, it's, it's not what you call a cinema film, but this film is what you describe as as the best of old Nollywood, taking the best of old Nollywood, what the fans truly loved and enjoyed about Nollywood, and then make a film in that way. This film is going to do well in places like Asaba, places like Enugu, places like Patakot. It's going to do well in Lagos, it's going to do well in Abuja, it's going to do well in Ibadan. And I think what she has here is something quite very, very special. And this is a woman that she's writing, she's directing, she's producing, she's acting. And I think, and I think, and I think we need to support people like Omoni Oboli. Um, I mean, from the time to Wives on Strike and I had seen the trailer, I knew there was some sort of sex deprivation thing going on. But I think what I didn't begin for, which I was pleasantly surprised, was the fact that they were actually doing that to stand for, against, to stand against child rights. I didn't see that part coming, but I, and I think that's what made this movie so beautiful and so intelligent, is the fact that we were laughing all through its comedy, but the message was still being sent home precisely and accurate and I think when you can strike that perfect dichotomy where it's entertaining but educative it's a home run I, I it's a home run I think this movie was just perfect we think this movie will make a lot of money in the cinema mm -hmm. yeah and we can't wait I think it's a film everybody should go and see because you will love it it's entertainment you know I say to people a lot when you make films make it entertaining it doesn't matter what the message is when you make it entertaining that's what will draw people to see it People will spend an evening on a date and watch this film and they will laugh and thoroughly enjoy themselves. You know, so I, I think that's a big plus for the film. Well, I think it's great. I think um, it's an entertaining film. I think it's a film the Nigerian audience will love and it's very refreshing. Now, I praise Omonio Boli's effort on this movie. I think she's done very well. She's produced, she's directed, she acted in it. It's a lot to combine. And I've seen Omoni, I, I think with the film she keeps releasing, it keeps getting better. So well done to Omoni. Okay, last but please tell us, how do you feel about uh, the success of today? I feel very blessed. You know, I mean, you do things and you just hope people will like it. And after the premiere today, I feel really, really blessed. Because, I mean, you were in the cinema, you heard everyone screaming and laughing and ooing and eyeing. And, it's just such a blessing that they've all come out and they love the movie and they, they can't stop talking about it. So I feel really blessed. Wife on Strike is comedy with a serious social message. That's the difference. Everyone needs to go to the cinema to go and watch Wives on Strike. Please, everybody, please support us. Watch Nigerian movies at the cinema. Watch Wives on Strike from 8th of April. It's going to be showing in every single cinema nationwide. Thank you. Hey people, this is Osiu KJ and this is Broadway TV. Keep watching. Hello, oh, my name is Julie Odia Akpata. I'm publisher of WOW Magazine. Keep watching Broadway TV. Hi, my name is Uzo Osinkwa and you're watching Broadway TV. Keep watching. I am Ken M. Baru, MD Film House Cinema and Film One Distribution. Stay tuned and keep watching Broadway TV. And you're watching Broadway TV. Keep watching. My name is Afagbae Lilian. Keep watching Broadway TV. Shay. <laughs>